hard to guess the reason why she hasn't said anything is because she knows her young stupid babies will just find her. Also, doesn't hurt to have babies people back in the Oh, yeah, you, you want to. Please, 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 officer. Hey, hey, stop right there. This is the police. Do you want to go? Do you want to go? Stop right there. This is the police. Oh, but he, he, he punched my taxi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. You don't want to taxi. I do, I do, I do. You stop arresting me. Oh, we're still going to arrest you. This is, this is citizens, are You're right. Come on. Shut up! Get in the car now! <laughs> Get in the car! That's right! Get in the car! He got arrested! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is kind of like beef. Fine. Dude. Oh, you think you can help? Oh, God, stop. Police officer, help me. Oh, I'm gonna punch you in the face. Hey, hey, stop that! It's the police! Yeah, arrest him, please! What the hell? What the hell are you? Yeah, yeah, you're being arrested. Just like a. Uh, uh, That's my taxi! How oh, dare you? We call 911. Damn it. Good oh. Jesse V. Example phone. 
photos are exactly what you're gonna get. They're just sort of examples, like I said. Each box is going to be totally individual, totally different. It's full of like magical what? things that I love so much. And a lot of the things in the boxes are things you guys have never seen before and were just made for this yeah. mystery box alone. So if you want to get yours in time for Christmas, because this Christmas is right around the corner, it's crazy. The link is down below in the description. All right, so let's get into today's video. So, as you guys know, symbols are constantly all around us. They are in the form of brand logos, traffic signs, emojis. I mean, I could go on and on, and there are a bunch of symbols that everybody recognizes all around the world. Like the cross, the heart, peace sign, apple logo, McDonald's arches, American dollar symbol. And this comprised the yellow circle with the two black dots representing eyes with a big black arc representing the mouth. So basically there was this insurance company back in 1963 and they hired a graphic designer to make them an art piece to make their workspace and business more cheery. They felt like their office was so dark and dreary opening a lot of business and they hired someone to make something happy, fun, something intriguing for Horror. 
whole show. So it's strange how they would use a happy face to represent that. It's because they're trying to use opposites. They're trying to mess with our minds. In the American Horror Story season called Cult, there's smiley face graffiti that pops up to mark those who are doomed to die next. So anybody who sees this creepy red smiley face on their wall, they know the clowns are coming after them. There's so many examples of happy faces being used for evil and dark things, and it only started happening, like, recently in modern day. There's even a horror movie called Smiley that came out in 2012, and the face of this smiley creature was purposely made to look exactly like the yellow smiley one. Obviously, it's, like, flesh color, which is <laughs> so creepier. I'm pretty sure Shane Dawson is actually in this movie, which is so random. Just general. 
the roof of the restaurant to grab the attention of passing motorists. So I guess they literally tried to make a Jack in the Box a Jack in the Box. But the clown was a little bit too uh, dark and spooky looking for a lot of people. It says by the late 1970s, the Jack in the Box executives began to feel that the clown mascot was a Excited about it. Kellogg's 
decided to create a mascot to match the products being pieced together. So they created like a Frankenstein monster as their mascot. The finished product was part chicken, part wolf, part moose, part pig, and all confusing. So people were like, what pig is that? That's kind of weird. And to end this video, we have lemon heads. This is a candy that I have never tried before, but let me tell you their mascot is nightmare inducing. It's basically this lemon head boy. It's like a boy with a lemon as his head and like he looks terrifying. His eyes are huge. He's always smiling. He just walks around in the commercials. Why is this actually a thing? I don't know if they're using like shock value to try and like get customers in or what their whole marketing scheme is here. But I don't know if this makes me want to try this. What? Stop doing prank calls. What the hell? Oh, 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 oh,